if you are like me you want to lose weight you want to look healthy you want to be at your best but you are just not interested in exercising and resting and breaking your sweat like that just try with me my tzapuli recipe and it might help you you might see the results just try we are not hurting yourself you're not hurting yourself it is healthy for you go on these things you made me feel I kinda know I wish you could see but you don't have a clue Bulgur is a boiled, cracked wheat So it's whole grain Once it's prepared, it's tender and fluffy It's very easy to consume and eat And please, please don't confuse it with couscous because they are not the same because couscous is actually just tiny pasta and the authentic tabbouleh is made with super fine grain it is soaked but there are also some people who cook it so what we're gonna do is just soak the bulgur that I have right now in the water like two three times just need to throw the water but you need to also strain the bulgur because you don't not want your tabula to be watery The next we're gonna be the next we're gonna be adding is fresh parsley because authentic tabbouleh uses ton of parsley and it is why the salad is so green obviously and and it does not matter honestly all you need to do is just chop it very small and very finely so that it's very pleasant to eat and adds this aroma and extra volume to the tabbouleh Oh, when it comes to the parsley, you can also just like chop it up into small pieces, or you can you can even or you can even use a food processor because chopping by hand might take some time. And don't remove the thin parsley stems; they offer a lot of great flavor and vitamins that you need. Honestly, you guys, I've been feeling like a Kardashian. Imagine just just eating the salad, how, like how they do, like every single day. A true Kardashian. You forget. You're like a chef these days. Very meticulous <laughs> about your pasta. <laughs> yeah. Um, just in case you're asking, green onion is very rich in nutrients, calories 4.8, sodium 2.4, carbohydrates 1.1, and the others contain from 0 0.4 to 0 0.5 grams. If you are someone who has had a chubby hand your whole life and then some suddenly you just start losing weight and then it just shows like that's how you know that it worked and not only that but even my collarbone just started popping um i've even lost some belly weight because of this not only that if you are muslim and you are fasting I, uh, ramadan mubarak and this really really does help just 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 freaking avoid the fried foods okay freaking avoid this foods you don't need this in your life these are trash okay not trash they are good but it's not good for you honey just keep them to the side okay then chop your tomatoes finely i have even seen that people also rather like um strain their tomatoes or just let the tomato juice just go out from the tomato which you can but i just don't because 
eating this every day i rather have it like a little bit watery than have it like dry for me all you have to do is just chop finely and then add them to your tabbouleh mix then add them to your tabbouleh mix so i'm just gonna add the previously soaked bulgur into the mix then i just take a fresh lemon i cut it up i squeeze it and i will add to the mix but later not now um then i'm gonna be adding some olive oil then you can even add salt and pepper and then just mix it up Then once when you're done mixing it up, if you want you can add anything else like garlic, just about one clove, nothing more and that's it, that's done. This is my presentation, thank you for watching us, joining and if you are following my losing weight process of eating like a tabbouleh every day, um, keep me up, let me know how is it for you too and your experience and bye.